Your skills are impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. You handle yourself well in a fight. I can pilot a shuttle, too, unless someone sabotages it. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. If you wanted to get me all alone in the wilderness, you could have just asked. Normally, I arrange a more romantic setting for my crashes. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. Just about into the main network. Someone's coming. Forgive the intrusion, but I come bearing tragic news. The Empress's shuttle has crashed. Crashed where? Somewhere in the jungle. Unfortunately, the emergency locator is not transmitting. That's... Uh, that's impossible. Not if the shuttle disintegrated. I'm afraid there's only one logical conclusion. The Empress and Commander are dead. alert. Deadly predators stalk these wilds. You could say the same thing about your cities. City predators won't eat our remains. Usually. Storms are fierce today. It will make a rescue attempt difficult. I never liked relying on others to save me anyway. 
A sound philosophy, one the Sith Code embraces. Forest to hunt you down was going to be the worst part of this job. It's so much easier when the targets come to us. You must know who we are. Do you really think you can beat us? The Geno Harridan feared no one. Not even you. The Geno Harridan? I thought you were just a myth. That's because we never leave witnesses. Destroyed, comm signals still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. The Geno Haradon must have a camp nearby. We can ride out the storm there. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. Nothing like a little danger to get the heart racing. I admire your persistence, but let's focus on our survival, shall we? Looks like the storm's not letting up anytime soon. I say we grab a shuttle and head out now. The interference will disable comms and scanners, not to mention the risk of an electrical surge frying our circuits. Sean, I just heard the news. Let me express my sincere condolences. SIS reporting has gone downhill since I left. The commander is missing, not dead. Don't let foolish hope blind you. You are leaderless, as are the Sith. Someone must step in to fill the void. Forgive me, but aren't you the former Republic Chancellor? You've already served your term. True leaders don't need titles to hold power. 
I want what your leader wanted, to defeat Valen. Join me, and we can finish what she started. Pass. I've had more than my fill of working with you. You're still grieving. Eventually, you'll realize I'm right. Storm be damned. The time for patience is past. Let's find the commander. Part of me is enjoying this. As Empress, I'm rarely able to test my martial skills anymore. I prefer to lead by example. Stay on the front lines. Among the Sith, being on the front lines just makes it easier for someone to stab you in the back. That was too close. The lightning strikes can be deadly out here. If we recalibrate the electrical towers, they will draw in the power of the storm and keep us safe. I fear the storm is getting worse. Good. It'll cover our approach to the Geno Harridan camp. I see why the Alliance follows you. Where others see problems, you see opportunity. Feel my wrath! Found bodies at the crash site. The scene her. In the Alliance. Fire. No. Ow. That means the targets are still out there. Find them. <laughs> Found out why Greg Squad didn't check in. Lightning strike. Survivors? None. All of them fried to a crisp. Salvage whatever gear you can and keep moving. Status report. Any sign of the targets? No visual contact yet. Hard to track them through the storm. Rain's wiped out the trail. Keep looking. Find them before they find us. Feel my rock. Suppose a shuttle was too much to hope for. I found something. It's not enough to simply crash the shuttle. I want to see the bodies. No bodies, no bonus. Chancellor Suresh, that Republic snake. Suresh is no longer in charge of the Republic. True. But intelligence believes she still holds significant power. Into the temple! Sure, there's another way out. Looks like we have some exploring to do. Lead the way, Commander. Reports from Drome and Cass claim the Outlander is dead. No. Father's spirit is still rattling around in there. His little pet is alive. The truth is irrelevant. The rumors have thrown the Alliance into disarray. 
Now is the perfect time to strike. Odessan is too heavily defended. That doesn't change just because their precious outlander is missing. Odessan is not the target. held the secrets to immortality. I was wrong. You seem to have found a way. The body is just a shell, a vessel for the spirit. Emperor of the Sith was my first face, but it is merely one of many I have worn. And what about the face you wear now? I found Valkorion centuries ago. He was a great warrior, a champion of ancient Zakul. It was only natural I hollow him out to use as my vessel. I saw potential in the primitive world, so I raised it to perfection. You speak of Zakul as though it's your favorite child. The Eternal Empire deserves more than my children ever did. When you take the throne, you will understand. We still need to go deeper if we hope to find another passage to the surface. Baywan, now's not a good time. This can't wait. Suresh just sent a message. She's heading here, to Odessan. Seems she didn't wait for us to change our minds after all. Send her pack in the second she lands. Some of the troops want to hear her out. They aren't sure the Alliance can last. There are rumors about the Commander. Remind them where their loyalties lie. Stall Suresh. We're on our way. Mr. Lawman warned us you might sneak off. This reminds me of my earliest trials as an apprentice, clearing vermin from tombs on Corriban. I remember those days too. It's like our lives have come full circle. No matter how much we change, some things remain the same. An important lesson. Sith Lords are revered on Droman Kass. But to move forward, we must abandon the old ways. Easy to say, harder to do. I understand your skepticism, but I will prove myself to you in time. Don't you know it's rude to make me come out in a storm like this? We should just seal the passage behind us, trapping you in here forever. Not an option. Suresh wants the corpses. No bodies, no bonus. You don't have to do Suresh's bidding, Lorman. You're better than that. 
It's Minister Lorman, and I don't answer to Suresh. We're partners. To Suresh, you're just a lackey. She'll turn on you the first chance she gets. The Alliance commander is right. But if you surrender now and beg for mercy, I might let you live. It's not Lorman's call. The Geno Harridan always finished the job. Where the opponents are so hard to find, and so fun to kill! I brought them right to you. Now finish them! Stay back! I've taken your friends hostage! Anything happens to me and they're dead! This is Minister Lawman. Let me speak to the prisoners. Oh, hello, Lawman. This is who you sent to capture us? I'm a little offended. I'm glad you're both safe. You gave us quite a scare. It's good to hear your voice. I was ready to hunt you down myself. Charging through the jungle to rescue me. How romantic. Don't forget the part where I wring the Chancellor's neck. Suresh wants the Alliance, Commander. She's on Odessa as we speak. Hold tight. I'm on my way. You are my guest. Would you like to execute the traitor, or should I? got a better idea. Slap a shock collar on him. Let others see what happens when they oppose you. That is a truly excellent plan.
Members of the Alliance, as many of you have already heard, your commander is dead. There are dark times ahead, but fear not. I have come to offer you a beacon. I assume you know everything, then. Admit what you did. I want to hear you say it. And give you the satisfaction? The Alliance needs a leader like me. I saw an opportunity and I took it. I won't apologize for that. We are well beyond apologies. What do we do with her? Execution, I expect. It's what Valen would do. It's what I would do. That's the difference between us. You get to live. Though you'll be in an Alliance prison for a long, long time. Take her away. You have no idea how happy I am. Empress Asina is waiting for your call, Commander. We'll meet you in the War Room. Never believed you were really dead, Commander. Not even for a second. Can't con a con artist, right? By the way, if anyone contacts you asking about a life insurance policy that paid out in your name, just say you don't know me, okay? Good to see you back in one piece, Commander. Don't know what the Alliance would do without you. Seeing you standing here, alive and well, I can't believe I almost fell for Suresh's lies. Welcome home, Commander. I apologize for everything on Droman Cuss, but I still believe we should unite your people with mine. You've proven yourself, Asina. I accept your offer. That doesn't mean you're home free. We're watching you. Knowing Theron, not even your Holonet activity is safe. Remind me to change my access codes. I look forward to working with you. Mayday! Mayday! This is the cargo freighter Rodala! Does anybody copy? Ten up where the gravestone. We got your back, Radala. You okay? I've taken heavy damage. Need to make emergency repairs. Roger that, Radala. We'll bring your freighter on board. Just hold tight. Much appreciated, Koth. Looking forward to meeting you in person. Distress call from the gravestone. Goth doesn't call for help unless... He got lonely? He's in trouble. Answer the call. I'm trying, but the signal's jammed big time on the other end. Hold on. Got it. Mayday! Mayday! Is anybody there? We read you, Goth. What happened? Valen and Scorpio tripped their way on board. They've taken the bridge and my crew. I'll scramble the fleet. 
Find a place to hide until we're there. I've got some tricks up my sleeve, but we don't have long. Lost him, but I have the coordinates. The Greystone is a distraction. Strike down, failing, and nothing will stand between you and the Eternal Throne. Shields, weapons, and sensors remain offline. The Alliance fleet is hailing us. Father's little meat puppet. How are you? Just calling to make sure you're still there. I'll be right over. I've never appreciated how funny you are. Die with your fleet if you like. But you'll never stand on this bridge again. We'll see about that.
Should have not. I'm used to you barreling through doors like a gun dog. Now that we're all here, what the hell is happening? Remember the first time you let Scorpio on my ship? It got me thinking we needed a few modifications. The Omni Cannon, Sublight Engines, and Hyperdrive remain locked down. Ugh, I hate playing with broken toys. <sighs> but you can fix anything. Koth's encryption key is personal. I need to learn more about him to break it, but I can't access a holonet signal through the battle. You served with him. He must have told you things. Yes. This is going to hurt. But there's a hidden passcode behind the main one. No one knows but me. If Valen unlocks the bridge controls without it, we're in real trouble. You ever heard of a quantum bomb? Oh, Koth, you didn't. Anyone who doesn't enter that hidden passcode starts a countdown. Everything for thousands of kilometers around us. Boom. You wouldn't set a trap that destructive without an off switch. I'm crazy. Not stupid. I came down here to disarm the bomb. Thought you might want to help. Valen's forces control the ship. I'll distract them. Go with Koth. Lana. You owe me a drink. I've got bomb fuses hidden on this deck. Come on. The quantum bomb was not my best idea. I know. No. meant to risk your lives. to protect the Alliance, not destroy our fleet. We're close. Just one more left. You're okay, Lynn. Just a little crispy on the edges. The encryption key is based on Goth's war record. Soldiers under his command who died. Stand by. Bridge controls are unlocked. The gravestone is mine. The 
have lost five patrols in the lower decks, on opposite ends of the ship. Koth is not alone. Oh, father. You shouldn't have. That's all the fuses down here. Next stop is someplace exciting. <laughs> Fuse is on the bridge with Valen and Scorpio and my crew. Focus on the bomb. I'll save your crew. I was gonna say you get Valen and I kill Scorpio. But your plan works too. Let's hit the bridge. Almost done. Knew we could do this together. Over there? We're alive. Took you long enough. I disabled the bomb fuse, but the bridge controls were already unlocked. My fault. I tried to resist, but Valen did things. She made me talk. I'm sorry. Consider yourself lucky to be alive. Lucky? Yeah. Doesn't make sense. They should have triggered the quantum bomb and killed us all. Quantum bomb? Get everyone to the escape pods. The only way we're alive is if they didn't use the console. What stopped them? Listen carefully. Time is short. No more games. We're not falling for your tricks again. My deception is keeping you alive. I manipulated Valen to leave the bridge so you could disarm your failsafe. You knew about that? I share your desire to save the gravestone. Stand by. Valen has cornered Lana Benico. You may wish to save her, too. Why are you suddenly helping us? This vessel is the key to everything. Oh no. Valen and Lana are fighting where I hid the bomb. If they trigger it, we're all dead.
underestimate Valen. Her power grows exponentially. Kill her, or you will die. <laughs> Scorpio said you'd come. I owe her credit. Scorpio is manipulating you, just like your father is using me. They want us to destroy each other. Don't let them win. Oh, wow. Hey! There's a bomb under your feet! You tear up this place, you'll set it off! Never mind! We've got three minutes! I've waited long enough. If I slice open your skull, maybe father will spill out. Time to die, father! Other brilliant plans. I am not finished. When I'm done with your precious Outlander, you and Mother are next. Such, Such hatred. You are my daughter. We are family. You caged me like an animal! You were a danger to yourself and others. I made you safe. You feared what I would become, and you were right. Kill me, and your father will be free to take another form. It might be you. He's too weak, and he knows it. Kneel before the dragon of the cool. No! Oh, that's not! Did you think I locked you away to punish you? No. You had to learn. You had to be conditioned. Kneel before the dragon of Zakul. What did you do to me? If you fight, you will die. Where's Balin? She's gone. No time to explain. I can't disarm the bomb with that shield in place. Take out the power relays. We're running out of time! The shield's still up! Kill more power relays!
That's it. Bomb over. The crisis may be averted, but my daughter still infests your shit. You did something to Phelan. Shut down her power. Her aptitude with the Force made her extremely dangerous. Even as a child, there was only one solution. I conditioned her subconscious to respond to a simple phrase. Kneel before the Dragon of Zakul. Speak these words in Valen's presence, and you activate her conditioning. She will be powerless to strike you. Now that Valen knows about her conditioning, she'll do anything to break free. What are her chances? She lacks the patience to break her mental cage. Now Valen's pride is wounded, her weakness exposed. She will be more dangerous than ever. I'm getting a signal from Theron. The Eternal Fleet jumped to hyperspace. It's just our ships out here. I've got reinforcements with me in the docking bay. Orders? Secure the bridge and don't take any chances. Alert me if you find Scorpio or Valen. Reinforcements! Hell yeah! And we didn't blow up! Next time you play with quantum bombs, keep me in the loop. Fair enough. You can help me install the next one. Kidding! This vessel is under my control. Organic beings have a few moments to abandon ship. After that, your lives are forfeit. Is that all I am to you? Another organic being you can't wait to get rid of? I have learned that the Gravestone, the Geminis, and the ships of your eternal fleet are all extensions of my technology. I must understand how we are connected. You've been after the Gravestone from the beginning. I have been seeking answers, and this vessel is one of them. You betrayed me, like all the rest. I am unlocking hidden files and subroutines in the gravestone that are older than the Eternal Empire. Let us keep a little perspective. You want perspective? Where are you taking us? The Gravestone wants to go home. Sight of Scorpio or Valen. They can't leave the ship while it's in hyperspace. If they want to re steal the gravestone, they'll have to come here. Wonderful. I'll make punch. The hyperdrive is locked. We're on this journey to the bitter end. Which is now. Sublight engines cutting in. Company! Lots of it! Fleet. Palin and Scorpio's transport. It's getting away. Open a comm channel. Find out who's aboard. No need for that. The transport is hailing us. Commander, I have made a wonderful discovery. The Gemini units, the Eternal Fleet, the Gravestone, they did not steal my technology. We are related. The Gravestone's computer revealed we were all created here, and you have aided our journey home. I promise to remember you kindly. If all this technology came from the same place, it changes everything we know about Sakul. Perhaps. But that is not your main concern right now. Valen and her remaining soldiers are sabotaging everything they can. You may wish to stop them. 
I'm seeing power surges all over. Shields, life support. The Omni Cannon. For whatever it is worth, I hope you survive. Koth, help me fix the Omni Cannon. The rest of you save the ship. <laughs>